In this video, we'll see how to publish for the iOS App Store. So to get started, we'll open the config XML in our app and modify the widget ID and the name of our app and the author information. We'll also modify the version number each time we upload a new version. So the widget ID will be the bundle identifier in iOS. And the name of the app must be a unique name that isn't associated already with an existing Apple app like Weather. So once that's completed, I am going to open up the Xcode project inside of the Platforms folder, iOS, and then we see our Weather Xcode project. We see all that config information matches up inside our project. We could also select device orientation. And then we'll go into Member Center from Apple. And we'll set up our certificate provisioning profile and app. So to get started, I'm going to hit the plus button next to certificate. Select that this will be an App Store certificate. And then I'll follow this information to create a CSR file. So once you do that, you will click Choose File and upload that file. So I've already done that, so I'm going to move on to the Apple ID. And give it the name of my app. Put in the bundle identifier. And we're not using any other app services, so just the default ones will be enabled. So now we'll create our provisioning profile for the App Store. Select the app that we want for this provisioning profile. The certificate that we want to connect to it. And we'll just give it a name that we will associate with this profile. And we can download that or we can just go into our Xcode project and it will be available to download. If you don't already have this account information linked, you can click the plus button at the bottom and select Add Apple ID and log into your account. If you click the View Details button, you'll see what we just created from the Member Center. That we can download it right here. And we've already downloaded the other profiles, so we don't need to do anything else there. And now we're going to go to iTunes Connect. And we're going to create a new app for our weather app. Fill out the info. You have to give it a unique name. So we're using Sunny Outlook instead of just Sunny. And we're going to do a clean, and then we're going to do a product build. And we're going to select generic iOS or our iOS device as the build target. And then we're going to go to product archive. This will package up the app for us so that we'll be able to upload it. And we'll select the account. Select upload, provisioning profile matches up. And we'll go back into iTunes Connect, and we can see our uploaded build. And then we can fill out the rest of this information. Select our build, and we can save it 
And once we fill out all the information, we can hit submit to the App Store.